A lot of people have talked about your work with with Bray Wyatt in WWE and how you know he pushed to, to you put you talked about how he pushed to get the music over the line. But I wonder, as such a creative being and as a band that's such a, a creative force, did you teach Bray anything? Did you learn? Because you've got such a visceral live performance, you know it is it is intense. It is you know it is encompassing. Every you know it, you, you really feel something when you you know you guys perform. And obviously he gave all he gave his all as a performer. And I wondered, did you teach Bray Wyatt anything, uh, Wyndham Road Thunder? And what did you learn from each other outside of the music? I don't know if I taught him anything, but I know that he allowed me to have input in in a further way than I would have ever expected. I mean, I think that the the song is very much our song. Um, our and his song. Um and yeah, he was just a really amazing creative force. And we agreed on a lot of things. Mm. And we were able to create something that, you know, maybe he started over here and we would work and work and work and kind of end up over here and get to something that we both thought was really cool. And, you know, when I send him the song, I send him a something this long kind of expressing what, how I imagined it being, how I imagined it representing his character and how I imagined it representing even just how it would, you know, when we talked about the beginning, we always kind of talked about, the idea of doing like an inverse stinger that was kind of my idea was like instead of like the loud sound or the glass break it should be something that makes you feel that exact same way mm -hmm. similarly to you know on our record how we're kind of talking about this thin reflective line between things that are kind of opposite but feel the same it should make you feel that excitement oh my god he's here but it should feel more like michael myers it should feel more like something far away that first note i because i played that piano at the beginning of the song because uh like it was hard to express to somebody how it should feel like it should really feel so soft and dynamically it's like coming from the back of the room mm. all the way until it reveals itself yeah. creepy yeah but at the same time we wanted it to feel like whoa he's here so there's a million things like that there's a lot that we were able to accomplish with that song uh, it's obviously a very sad thing at this point. It's like not even a song I probably listened to for a long time, but you know he was awesome, man. He was he was really awesome. That's all I can really say. Mm -hmm.